the stages and progression of breast cancer form a tissue. Welcome to a comprehensive exploration of breast cancer, a critical topic that affects countless lives. Today, we will be your guide in understanding the intricacies of breast cancer's journey through its various stages. To delve deeper into breast cancer, a thorough understanding of its causes and developmental process is essential. Breast cancer originates from the abnormal growth of cells within the breast tissue. Key factors contributing to its development include genetic mutations, such as BRCA1 and BRCA2, which play a significant role in driving uncontrolled cell growth. Additionally, excessive interaction with hormones like estrogen and progesterone can also lead to unregulated cell proliferation, contributing to the formation of cancer. The progression of breast cancer is evident through its distinct stages. At the outset, we encounter stage zero, also known as carcinoma in situ. In this stage, cancer cells are confined within small pockets, yet to infiltrate the surrounding tissue. Detection often relies on advanced imaging techniques such as tomosynthesis and ultrasound. Stage one marks the initial invasion into nearby tissue. Initially, breast cells function normally, following a regulated cycle of growth and repair. However, when genetic mutations occur, normal cells can transform into cancerous ones. These cells lose the ability to self-regulate division and apoptosis, giving rise to the formation of tumors. We distinguish between two substages. Stage 1a. Tumors under 2 cm in size, with no spread to lymph nodes. Stage 1b. Tumors under 2 cm, but with limited involvement of lymph nodes, or tumors between 2 to 5 cm in size without lymph node spread. As we progress to stage 2, the cancer grows further and may extend its reach. Substages vary based on tumor size and lymph node involvement, shaping treatment decisions and outcomes. Transitioning to stage 3, we witness the deeper infiltration into nearby lymph nodes and surrounding tissue. Just like before, substages offer nuanced insights into the disease's extent. As cancer cells proliferate and invade surrounding tissues, they gain the ability to spread through the bloodstream and lymphatic vessels, leading to the metastatic stage. That's stage 4, the metastatic phase, where cancer cells journey to distant organs through the bloodstream or lymphatic system. And the treatment methods for this stage may include chemotherapy, Chemotherapeutic agents are used to reduce tumor size, manage symptoms, and inhibit further spread. Chemotherapy can be administered through oral medication or direct intravenous injection. Surgery. Surgical procedures can be performed to remove a portion of the tumor or alleviate pressure from the tumor on surrounding organs, thereby reducing symptoms. Hormone therapy. For hormone receptor positive breast cancers, Hormone medications such as tamoxifen can be employed to control the growth of cancer cells. The journey of breast cancer is multifaceted, marked by distinct stages that demand tailored attention. By staying informed, we empower ourselves and those around us in the fight against breast cancer. Thank you for joining me on this enlightening journey. Remember, early detection and regular screenings are vital in the battle against breast cancer. Consult your health care provider for personalized guidance. Disclaimer. This video provides general information and should not be considered a substitute for professional medical advice. Always consult with a qualified health care provider for proper diagnosis and treatment.